Wow. Whoever knew a train ride would be so fun? Especially if that train happens to be Thomas pulling Annie and Clara Ball. I know right. I used to watch the original Thomas the Tank Engine when I was younger. So did I. And then they made the terrible remake which sucked donkey balls. Good grief. They have to ruin everything don't they? Oh yeah. And Lamar, I just want to take this moment to say that I am sorry for wishing you an unhappy birthday. And I also apologize for the way that your parents treated you. They went way too far on the punishments that they gave you, especially on your birthday. And I apologize for making that unhappy birthday video out of you. It has now been disowned which means it is no longer relevant. It is quite alright, I am prepared to forgive you. And it says here that an arrest warrant has been issued for your parents. So hopefully, they will be arrested and they will never hurt you again. Good. I hope the police track them down and lock them up. I agree with you Adam. I hope those child abusers rot behind bars. With that out the way, let's just enjoy the rest of the ride. Good idea Callum. Oh great. It's Adam again, and he is with his friend Callum. And to make matters worse he is on a train which is from a toddler show. Honestly, I wish Thomas could just fall into the river. Wait a second. Fall into the river. That gives me a marvelous idea. I will blow up the train bridge, so that Thomas will fall into the river below. Both Adam and Callum will be killed, and neither of them will be able to make grounded videos out of me ever again. Ha 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 ha. And just to make sure the driver doesn't stop the train, I will hit him with a tranquilizer dart. I think that's Thomas coming right now. Time to execute my plan. Ah. Why do I feel like I'm going to go to sleep all of a sudden? Maybe I just need to go and get some air. Alright, that's the driver incapacitated. Time for phase 2 of my plan. I'm going to set the fuse for just enough time for me to get off the bridge. There. That should do the trick. Now to get out of here before the bomb detonates. Wait a second. Did you hear that? It sounded like an explosion. Yes, I heard it as well. It also sounded like something collapsed, like a bridge or a building. Whatever it is, I hope it's not a terror attack. I hope not either, Rex. Oh dear. I can't stop. Somebody, please help me. What the hell? Why did Thomas just race through that station without stopping? He always stops at that station. Clearly something isn't right here. I have a bad feeling about this as well Cecilia. First we heard an explosion, and now Thomas didn't stop at the station like he's supposed to. Clearly something is going on here and we need to find out what. I'll go and check on the driver to see what's going on. Oh no. The driver is unconscious. Wake up driver. Can you hear me? Say something. No response. Come in engine one. Do you copy? I had better go and respond to that radio. Yes, I read you loud and clear. This is Captain Rex of the 501st Clone Trooper Battalion. This is the fat controller speaking. Please may I talk to the engineer? Unfortunately the engineer is unconscious and I can't seem to wake him up. I was contacting you to inform you that the bridge has collapsed, and if the train does not stop, it will plunge into the river below. That explains the explosion, but I'm afraid I do not know how to control a train. I'm a qualified train driver and I would help you, but most trains have different controls so unfortunately I cannot. See if there is our passenger who is also a train driver. Right away. I'm afraid I have some alarming news. The driver has been incapacitated and the bridge has collapsed, 
and if this train isn't stopped soon, we are going to crash into the river below. I have no idea how to control trains so that means we have no means of stopping this train at all. I know this is alarming, but please try to stay calm. Does anyone know how to control a train? Me and Cecilia are both qualified train drivers, so we should be able to stop the train. But the thing is, if we stop suddenly, we will derail. Well, luckily I can pull the train from the back to stop it from derailing. Good. Now let's hop to it. Alright, I think this lever here is the brake. I hope you're right. Okay, I'm at the back of the train. Do it now. You heard Adam. Pull that lever. Phew. That was a close one. I know right, Thomas. We did it, Cecilia. We saved everyone on the train. Good thing Adam was here to stop the train from derailing. Good job. Now I just need to call the emergency services to tell them about what happened. I am really sorry to hear that your journey got disrupted. I will see that you are compensated for the inconvenience. Do you know how the bridge collapsed? It turns out that someone placed a bomb on the bridge and detonated it, causing it to collapse. We also found out that the same person who detonated the bomb hit the train driver with a tranquilizer so that he couldn't do anything to stop the train. We checked the CCTV footage and it turned out it was a woman with blue hair who is responsible. I know who that is. That's Jessica. She is part of a dangerous gang of troublemakers called the Alanis Teams. I think you may be right Adam. In that case, I will go and arrest her right now, so that she can be punished for her actions. And I'm friends with Jessica's guardian. I will tell him about what happened so that Jessica can be grounded and forced to eat lumpy potatoes. Ha 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 That was so fun. I really love the way the bridge collapsed. Adam and Callum are dead and Thomas is destroyed. No more grounded videos out of me or any more episodes of one of the worst TV shows ever. I bet the police won't even arrest me. Oh crap. I guess I spoke too soon. No. Stop crying like a motor car you bitch. You're coming with me, Jessica, I'm arresting you for destruction of a train bridge and attempted murder. You do not have to say anything, but it may harm your defense if you do not mention when questioned something which you later rely on in court. Anything you do say will be given in evidence. Do you understand that? Yes officer. Good. Now let's get you to prison. Oh, and Adam Hughes will be telling Dandy Andy about what you did. I'm pretty sure he won't be happy with you. Oh, 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 Jessica, I cannot believe you blew up a train bridge. Don't you know that you put many people's lives at risk? You are very lucky that Thomas did not crash because it would have potentially killed everyone on the train and it would have meant an even more serious charge than the one you already have. Not to mention, I now have to pay a massive bill for the bridge to be rebuilt, which costs more than the jump HQ. These things aren't cheap you know, if we keep having to pay fines and bills like this, Jump will go bankrupt, we will be out of our jobs and possibly living on a street in a cardboard box and it will be all your fault. That's it. You are grounded until the bridge you destroyed is rebuilt, and while you are grounded, you will be eating nothing but lumpy potatoes for every meal. Go sleep on your bed right now, you horrible bitch. I swear to God, if you don't stop crying like a goddamn motor car, I will personally use Beyond Logic to turn you into one, and give you always a prize on one of Vance's game shows. When I was a kid, I used to watch the original Thomas the Tank Engine which was narrated by Ringo Starr. I had all the toys and merchandise back then. Thomas the Tank Engine was my life. It's a shame they ruined it in the reboot. In the reboot, they replaced all the models with CGI. I mean just look at this abomination. Clearly they don't know the saying, if it ain't broke don't fix it, and they had to go and ruin it. 
On the plus side, at least you can go back and watch the original series on DVD. I'm sure you can buy a copy on Amazon or your favorite DVD shop. The technology they used to film the show is somewhat primitive, but it is always a joy to watch. And before I wrap up this video, the next video will feature Lamar's parents being arrested by Curtis Stryker and Sonia Blade for their crimes. Please note that I have nothing against Corey Comedian 1993 nor am I trying to spread hate, but the punishment in the video where they give Lamar a punishment day on his birthday went way too far. The video where they get arrested will be fairly short, so you shouldn't have to wait too long for it to be released. And with that out of the way, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, comment like and subscribe, and I'll see you all next time. This is Callum Rockley signing off.